Assalamualaikum Rahim. Welcome to BT604 Industrial Biotechnology. In this lecture, we will study about the metabolic engineering and how we use this metabolic engineering in order to enhance the production or produce a desirable new product. So, metabolic engineering is the practice of optimizing genetic and regulatory processes within the cell to increase the cell production of a certain substance. So, normally in nature, the cell is is actually a machinery and itself it is producing a particular product so what we are doing that we are actually metabolically engineering these cells and hijacking their uh, um, cellular activity and all the processes and as a result they will produce more product some of the common strategies used for the metabolic engineering are over expression the gene encoding the rate limiting enzyme bi biosynthetic pathway for example a particular gene is producing uh, a specific product so there is actually an enzyme that is controlling the production of that uh, product so what we are doing that we will limit this enzyme that is controlling the rate so when while limiting the in this enzyme the end product will automatically increase then blocking the competitive metabolic pathway so normally there is a feedback mechanism once there is a product is produced then another pathway activates and that decreases this product so what we are doing that we will stop and block the competitive metabolic pathway and the product will not be utilized with by this metabolic pathway and at the end we will get the desired product heterologous gene expression what we can do that we can incorporate more and more genes of that particular desired product and at the end we will get more product then enzyme engineering once we engineer these enzyme and their productivity will enhance and the product we will get more and more product metabolic engineering typically uses recombinant dna technology to develop microorganism giving improved product yield and having totally new pathways such designer organisms can be seen as cell factories and form the uh, cornerstone of industry biotechnology. So what we are doing that we are using designer organism in order to enhance the metabolic pathway or the pathways are created. So these cell factories are actually producing the desired product that are used by human. So here we can see that this is the initial design for, for example at the we initially design a pathway we can see that there are no products then we build and built and we incorporate either incorporate the gene or we use any of the above mentioned uh, processes then we test for the product here we can see that the intermediate design produce uh, number one produce less number two produce more and number three produce more than these two designs so after the final test we can see that the productivity is actually increased now what are the goals? The goals are that mathematical modeling of micro, microbial metabolism directs toward both steady state and dynamic models. Design of new pathway and synthetic microorganism focusing on the synthesis of molecules and product new to nature. So what we are doing that we are actually producing more product but also at the end we are producing products that are new to nature and that are totally synthetic and that are not produced by the nature itself.